Hey guys, happy Thursday, June 11th. So I'm just bringing you guys along like I promised for a lot of, well, just little t task all around the house. That's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna show you what I've done to the closet here. This closet, it just still has my books in there, my luggage, my, um, what do you call that? My tennis racket. And these are like my fall winter clothes. So I do have all my summer stuff. I'm going to say summer slash same thing for all. I got all my t-shirts and shorts and my blue jeans and like dresses in here. So I got that done. And like I said, I have to get these. I'm going to be putting um, those, these here and this thing. So you know what? Maybe I'll just, uh, I can kind of like do that now and get it out the way. So that would be done already. So yeah. Guys, I'm just, like I said, bring you guys along the process you said you wanted to see. So, this is part of my uh, packing process. So, let's get this done. Um, just have to unzip this. I don't even, I don't think there's, oh, I don't think there's nothing in here. Not, that I, not to my knowledge. I don't even think that's the right one, but... Yeah, not to my knowledge. Anything is in here. Oh boy, let's see. And if it is, it's too bad. Oh yeah, that's my luggage pillow. So we'll just put. Mm, hold on, y'all. We'll just put this stuff in here. Ugh. So that way, that will be over with. Okay, so now that's a wrap. So, guys, yeah. Um, so, yeah, I'll see you guys, um, I guess, in another part of uh, the video uh, momentarily, okay? Okay, guys, I wanted to show y'all one more thing. Um, I didn't no longer share a closet. Well, I, I switched closets. So I'm debating on because in the sitting room at the new place, there is a, there's a, like, there's a shelving unit in there, but it doesn't, it's like a shelf. So basically the shelf is, yeah. what I was trying to say, guys, there is shelving in the unit. But I'm thinking, I'm going to show y'all. Y'all let me know. Do I want to take these shelves with me. So this, for all you guys that maybe never seen my how I organize my shoe closet, this is all my shoes. These are hats. Uh, there's two pairs of sandals downstairs. So these are all my shoes. If you guys were wondering, I don't have a lot of shoes, which I don't. That's not me. But there's a fan and two my boots. My boots all my boots are down here. Uh, my All my black dress shoes, pumps, whatever, mules. Same thing, the cream ones and black pair of sandals. And like I said, my hats. So there is, you guys remember, we had shared this. Well, no, this was his closet. So he ended up taking the closet downstairs. So anyway, I end up not using that. So I'm trying to rethink, should I take this or leave that here? It's removable. And we did this ourselves. So I'm trying to think, should I take that? 
Y'all let me know in the comments what do you think. But I want to take it because, like I said, I can use that in a closet, in the sitting room closet. And I can put my plants on the shelves and I don't have to worry about buying no type of um, contain. I mean, no kind of unit or anything. I'm not trying to, like, bring more things with me or add more things. I'm trying to have less stuff but space. So let me know in the comments, what do you guys think? Do you guys think that is a good idea for me to do so? Um, the next video you guys will see. Oh, it's super bright. Hold on, y'all. Oh, wait, wait a minute. It's a little bit too bright. Yeah, so the next video you guys will see. Y'all got, it's just so much going on. But I was pulling in um, the hooks up out of the ceiling for my plants. I did the bathroom and I did in here. Uh, and I still do have to do two upstairs, but I can kind of like reach them with my hand. So anyway, let me know in the comments. Do y'all think I should take it? I'm, my heart is telling me, yeah, take them. So yeah, I will see you guys in another video. I think my next video will be me showing you guys uh, the information about the Berkey filter because I did receive it. So guys, yeah, I'll see ya. Guys, one thing I am learning about moving is when you move, you really find out that you really don't need stuff or you really don't need what you think you need. You just need the basics. And I'm looking around. I'm, well, I'll show you guys in a minute what I've decided to, um, I'm going to just give my daughter because I'm just going to show y'all. I'm going to give her this because to be honest, when we went to the Goodwill one time, she seen the table that I kept telling her I probably wanted to buy like from Ross or TJ Maxx and stuff. And remember it was only $250 plus an extra discount. And I said, oh my gosh. But when I showed her and told her I really wanted it, it's kind of like, she, I think she was at the point where she felt like, and I kind of understand, well, I found it, mom, and I like it too, although you wanted something like that. By me being so persistent, like, I'm, I'm just going to get it, I kind of feel like she really, really wanted it. So she doesn't know yet, but look, y'all. Y'all remember this table here? I'm going to give her this. Uh, actually, she's traveling right now, and she'll be back in a couple of days. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put this in her car and I can always move this guys. I have, like, I got this table. I got the hutch in here. I have the, um, that, that shelf in unit that we made. Oh wow. It was too dark that we made in the dining room area. I have that. So I have shelving units and little tables to put stuff on. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and like I said, I'm going to put it in her car and give it to her. Because I'm thinking, like, I really don't need that. And I already have, like, I have this one and that one. So, let's make this clear. Right now, I'm just going to go ahead. Hopefully, this doesn't fall. Please don't fall. I'm going to put this right here. Set it on top of it. Because it's going back in this box when I move. But I'm going to take this and I'm going to set it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and set it by the door. So, that way, I will already have it near the door. And I will remember. Because, actually her car is here so what i'll do is i'll just put it in her car because i don't want to do it like right now because it's too warm and i don't want the the uh, mirror to shatter or break so i'm, I'm just going to surprise her with it but yeah i'm i'm learning that moving y'all i've been here it's been 11 years so it just goes to show you like what you can accumulate that's why i try to live as simple as possible guys because i don't want that issue i don't want um that problem so yeah, I'm going to gift her that. And yeah, this is what, this is where I hung the one plant right here, guys. Because like I said, I wanted to get all the things out of the way. So for right now, this hangs on the hook here. And that way I don't have to worry about it. So yeah, guys, um, I'm trying to think what else. I think that's really about it. I hope you guys are enjoying these small little pieces and clips of the moving process here. And I don't know if I showed y'all, um, down here, let me show y'all real quick. Right down here is all the, um, right here is all, I don't know if you guys can see, but right there is all like um, holiday, not holiday stuff, but like when the seasons change for winter, then I got all the bathroom stuff from out of that bathroom. And then like when you turn the corner there, I have all the, um, the boxes, like one to my, to the Keurig and a box to the TV upstairs. And it's a box for, oh, a box for the printer. So, yeah, that's really, everything is basically almost done. So, guys, I hope you, wait a minute. Let me see something. Oh, gosh, it's too bright. 
slow down hold on okay there we go so what i was saying is i hope you guys are enjoying these small doses of moving uh i'm gonna say moving chronicles i guess um and i will bring you guys along for another one like i said the next video you will see i am it's going to be about the berkey okay so um i'll see you guys in another video really really soon peace and blessings to you all remember to live simple live free because it helps you it really does help you and um peace and love to all of you guys and thank you all for tuning in keep coming with the questions and things like that let me know in today's video what all did you enjoy in this video and then also um remember to love yourself so that you can love others and this world will be a better place i'll see you guys in the next video really soon bye guys guys i had to come back and share something with y'all um it's very important to keep your boxes and stuff but guess what i end up plugging the uh bullet up to another outlet and, and it came on so i'm so glad i keep my boxes but you guys it's so funny how it's it's easy to go and spend your money and buy something it's hard when you have to exchange it or return it the stores will give you a hard time y'all know what i mean let me know in the comments has anybody ever been through that uh i do that's one thing that's one of my pet peeves i don't like you know um if I buy something and I want to return it or exchange it, I should be able to if I have the box, the receipt, and all that stuff instead of giving me a hard time. It's not a hard time for you to receive my money, but it's a hard time when I want to exchange something. I don't understand that. That's why I don't buy a lot. But let me show y'all really quick that I end up placing it in this socket over here, and it came on. So look. I don't have, there's nothing in there, but it does work. So I'm so grateful for that. And I just wanted to share that with you guys. You guys know I like to share good things. And I was praying. I'm like, Lord, I don't want to buy another one. I don't want to have to go through all the hassle. So, yeah, keep your boxes. And, um, yeah, just keep hope alive when things break down because they might not be broke. They might need you to do an investigate, do a little investigation. So I investigated that that other socket, something might be wrong with it. So, guys, I'll see you. Bye. Just want to let you know how beautiful God is. Take it all in because he's awesome and amazing. Guys, I came back for a moment to show y'all something. I went by the African store because I said I would never go and buy um, no more um, any products or nothing like that unless it's from the African store. And, um, I end up going to where I get my body oil from. And whenever I do, when I, when, I, when I get the black woman, I get it from the African store. And he gives me a deal because he lets me sell my products in his store. So we kind of like feed off each other. Um, I bought raw shea butter, y'all, in the raw. So today, I'm glad I stopped. Something in my spirit told me to stop because I was in the area. But today was um, no tax day in his store. So I got this big old thing of raw shea butter. You see it? Ten dollars, y'all. Ten dollars. So yeah, I'm so grateful for that. But I just wanted to uh, let you guys know that um, that was on my um, that wasn't on my list today but God is good he led me in the right direction for a reason and um, yeah I'm so excited about this I got it out the way I don't have to worry about y'all this would last me for years I mean not not years but it would last me for let me put my seatbelt on it's gonna last me I'm gonna say probably till next probably around this time next year yeah so yeah so guys yeah i'm so guy i'm so excited so i will see you guys in my next video i just wanted to put that out there y'all bye bye it's so beautiful today so beautiful um what else is going on i said bye but i'm still talking i am also going to go to bed bath and beyond because i am in the area and i'm going to go get a small thing of Dr. Bronner's. Yeah, a small thing of Dr. Bronner's. And I'm going to use my, um, oh, it's warm. And it's with the windows up. I'm going to use my 20% uh, off coupon. So, yeah, guys, I will see you guys later. Peace and blessings. Guys, I said I'll come back. I think I said I'll come back and show you what I got from um, Bed Bath & Beyond. It wasn't that bad in there. And I'm glad I was able to see one of my girlfriends. Well, somebody I've been knowing for a long, long time. Um, we connect here and there on um, Instagram. 
or uh, Facebook. So, guys, I spent seven dollars and let me get this right. I spent seven dollars and seventy-five cents. Let me show y'all really quick here, without y'all seeing where my where I'm at or whatever. Really don't care, but seven seventy-five if you guys can see. And I think I did really, really good. I got this um, raw organic noni fruit powder. Um, it's vitamin C, polysaccharides, saccharides, uh, and iron. It's really, really good. I haven't seen noni products in a long time. So I got this, and I'm grateful for that. And this was marked down to $4.98. And it took off like, um, let me see, let me get this right. It took off, it ended up being... It took off it was it took off a dollar so it's 398 instead of 498 so that's not bad and this is enough to do a lot so I can put this in smoothies and I actually went in there for the dr. Bronner's I started to buy the big one then I said no I'm just gonna go ahead and um get the small one so this one ended up costing me uh, 319 instead of 399 so I got this one and this is the size you guys I did I got and this is for everything. And you know you only you could dilute it a little bit. So yeah, I am happy with my finds. And I said I would bring y'all along if I um did so. So yeah. Um that's gonna really end this video because I know I said that before, but really it's gonna end the video. So guys, um I'm, I appreciate you guys hanging out with me. If that's what you did, if you walked watch all the way through, because I keep saying that. I'm done. But anyway, I'm really done this time. God bless you all. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being supportive, for watching me on my journey and um, my life journey. And guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Not in this video, but in another video. Okay? All right. So long, y'all.